All right, hello everyone. Simon here. Welcome back to our Minecraft survival playthrough. We are underneath the ocean monument, and we're building a guardian farm. Uh, since last week, I have gone ahead and oh, I should probably sleep because it's night time, right? Excuse me. So, uh, the wooden fence doesn't work because the Water mobs do not recognize wooden fences as solid, so they just try to swim against it, and they get stuck against it. So I have, inside the wooden wall, the fence wall, I've put, I mean the dolphin's still doing that. Inside the fence wall, I've put blocks, there's a uh, glass and pauper. So now at least the mobs on the inside don't try to swim through it. And so they don't get stuck. Right. Uh, at some point I might just remove all the fence blocks as well. Because there's no point having a double wall there, right? So I'm going to remove all the fences. I might do that in my own time because it's going to be just tedious. And not very interesting. Right now, today, I'm going to build 20 more of these modules. So these modules catch uh, water mobs and we need to fill the entire or we need en enough coverage of the entire monument to make sure we catch most things okay right first off magma blocks don't even know how many we'll need but let's go ahead and so these things lined up with those right so there and there Two, three, four, five. Wait, no, it's only four, my bad. You can hear things being caught. Let me go this way, set up the square. Right? That and then and there you go, and we just need to do that all the way around. What are we looking at here? Now we want this and two, three, four, one, two, three, four, just there. That one. Uh, what's going on here? Oops. Okay. Uh, there you go, and then we fill in the rest of this, right? Double check. Wow. <laughs> wow. Okay. There, I mean.
Might need more magma blocks. Here, hey, Harvard. Uh, okay, that's wrong. I meant to put that there. One, two, three, four. How is this getting anything good in the Steam sale? I haven't even looked at it. I don't think I'm... I mean, I've got no plans to buy anything. Because I've actually got all the games <laughs> that I want to play for now. What about you, Hava? Any uh, good buys or recommendations? One, two, three, four. I literally have too many games. that I don't have time to play. Especially since I'm in the habit of buying things that are really good value for money. <laughs> I need more. Like, you, you buy a game that you know you would spend a hundred hours on, or like multiple hundreds of hours on. <laughs> and, uh, you know, you don't need that many of those. <laughs> It turns out. I was just, I got a couple of bullet hells like Vampire Save, Feather Survivors, Time Wasters, and Soul Stone Survivors, both of which are really good. Got Hunter Call of the Wild. Probably spent a long time on all three. It sounds good. All have steep sails, says Harva. Uh, let's see what I have. Got that, you got that. I'm playing Monster Hunter right now. Uh, that's gonna be like multiple hundreds of hours. <laughs> so, when did I buy that? I forgot. I only buy things on sale anyway. I didn't buy them on the Steam sale. I think they were like on individual sale. But sales happen so often on Steam that you don't you're not really worried about missing out. How is this that looks like a good game? Ah, Monster Hunter is not buying Diablo 4 then. I have no plans to buy Diablo 4. <laughs> Maybe later? Monster Hunt is one of these games that it takes a bit to get into because there's a lot of mechanics. It's, it's a pretty old series by now. And every new game, they add more stuff. <laughs> and so, like, at this point, getting into Monster Hunter, you have to catch up on a lot of mechanics. Uh, but once you do, it's a great game because it's, there's so much depth in it. Hava says, yeah, only buy sales too these days, burn too many time on full price AAA games. <laughs> Who even pays full price anymore? Hava says, have you seen some streams on Diablo 4? To me it looks like Diablo 3, but with fancy graphics. I haven't looked at any streams. 
What I mean, I haven't looked. I haven't looked enough at enough streams to really come to any conclusions. Um, I don't know though. I mean, the basic gameplay is going to be pretty much the same because you're not going to reinvent the wheel now. But I think there ought to be some systems changes, right? I don't know. I mean, there wasn't anything wrong with Diablo 3, right? If if they keep adding more content, I would keep playing it. So, it's not like they need to change it a lot. Right? Um... Okay, how many stacks of hoppers do I need? 16 times 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 stacks just for the bottom bits, and then another 5 stacks for the cards above. Although I'm not sure how they would keep adding more content with Diablo 3. Because Path of Exile... I can never, like, keep playing it. <laughs> like, you play it for a bit, and then it just gets kind of really repetitive to me, Path of Exile. So I'm not sure how you would... Yeah, I don't know how the... I don't know how the like, keep that genre interesting. However says, yeah, that's the problem. Why fix something that isn't broken? But then you get people not wanting to pay full price for a game that's just a reskin with the occasional gameplay change. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I don't know. I like I don't I don't have any good solutions. It's not like it's not like I know the secret to <laughs> to making the the series fresh and interesting. <laughs> I also have no idea what they're supposed to do. What do we have with planks, planks, planks? Let me what do I do? Okay, log back there. In fact, let me put The logs away. Sixteen. Do I actually have enough? One, two, three, four. How's this? They could do so much with the law. Oh yeah, yeah, you're right. But it's not like they're gonna leak the law because if they leak the law, they spoil the whole game. Maybe they do do a lot with the law, right? Well, maybe you're right. Maybe all the new stuff is in the law. One, two, three, four. Four and a half. You need five, don't you? Boxes and hoppers. Two, three, four. Hey, you need a lot more iron than this, it turns out. Uh, oops. I didn't mean to put that many. In there. Three, four, chess, hoppers. How many did I say I need? Five stacks? Wait a minute, do I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight? I don't actually have enough wood, do I? I 
I think I miscounted. I think I actually need twice as much wood as I actually have. Yeah, I need a, I need a lot more wood than this, I just realized. <laughs> Uh-oh. We're gonna have to go back to chopping trees. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Five. Okay, hopper time. Why? Why does it put it on top? Oh, because I'm standing there. If I'm standing... No, if I'm standing... No, that's not right. Why does that put it on top? Did they change the crouching? Why is the crouching slower? They made it so that... The crouching crosshair... Doesn't follow the view, it follows where you... Right, so, so this... Because... I'm pointing there, and then if I crouch... It places it there instead of where the pointer is now. So that's a bug. That's something they they changed the way crouching works. And they did it wrong. I have no idea why they would change the crouching though. It's not like crouching was broken or anything, was it? Like here, if I point it down there... Yeah, no, you can see the, the outline is on that block. Even though the, the cursor is pointing to, to this block, the outline's back there, so when I click... Oh, you can't even do that. Wait, what? That's... okay, I don't know why that does that, but okay. Doesn't make any sense. What games have I bought recently? Like games I bought that I haven't played <laughs> because I th I bought Forza Horizons. Was it Forza Horizons the latest one, whichever the, whichever it is, which is a a driving game, open world driving game. Uh, I bought Anno 1800 which is a, an economy slash city builder game. And I'm not going to play those for like months, <laughs> possibly for another year, up to another year before I actually play either of those games. <laughs> because it turns out Monster Hunter is a multiple hundreds of hours game. 
How is this 5, if I recall correctly? It's probably 5, you're right. It's, I think it's Forza Horizon 5. I mean, it might have been a mistake even doing that, because by the time I get around to playing it, <laughs> it's quite possible that 6 would be out already. <laughs> Ah, too many games, not enough time. <laughs>